The Australian Volunteers for International Development, AVID, program is an Australian government initiative. The program offers a range of opportunities for the Australian community to share skills and foster linkages with people and organisations in developing countries to make a difference as part of Australia's overseas aid program. Volunteer assignments are available across a number of sectors including marketing, agriculture, human rights, environment, health and many others. Scope Global is one of three organizations which deliver the AVID program. Scope Global mobilizes skilled and experienced Australians on volunteer assignments across Asia and the Pacific. Well, Australia has been sending um, volunteers for development to Bangladesh since 2000. Uh, that's 15 going on 16 years now. Um, but it builds on a much longer pedigree of Australian uh, volunteer activity in this region, the Indo-Pacific, stretching back a couple of generations. Uh, Australians for many years have sought out these sorts of opportunities overseas because they're motivated, they want to contribute, they're adventurous, they want to learn something ab uh, about this region, contribute to it and take home that experience with them. I'm Jade, I'm currently living and working in Cox's Bazaar, a coastal town in southeastern Bangladesh where I'm on a 14-month AVID assignment through Scope Global with the United Nations World Food Program. I've also played a central role designing and monitoring the early stages of EFS. I put in place a third-party monitoring system for beneficiary selection and worked closely with our NGO implementing partners to improve their targeting. Since 2000, Australia has sent uh, over three, or about 350 volunteers uh, to Bangladesh as part of its uh, volunteers program. Well, in the history of the program, the 15-year history of the program in Bangladesh, uh, Australia has sent uh, or placed volunteers in over 130 organisations in Bangladesh. They're both local organisations, uh, international organisations and Australian organisations. Uh, about 30 Australian organisations have hosted uh, international volunteers, but it's important to, uh, to really appreciate the variety of institutions in which Australian volunteers have worked. My name is Ilari Latonen. Uh, I'm from Melbourne. I have been working as a Waste Management Training Officer for the last 15 months at Waste Concern. One of the big successes has been the longevity of the project. Uh, by not simply being a pilot or a prototype, um, but being a project that has all the partners committed to technical support and knowledge transfer for a number of years. Hi, my name's Maria. I'm originally from Adelaide, South Australia, and I'm currently living in Dhaka, Bangladesh. I'm here on a volunteer assignment for one year, um, which is managed by Scope Global, a company based in Adelaide. My day-to-day -day activities really vary. So one day I could be taking photos of a new product and then editing them to be uploaded to the website. I could be writing a newsletter, or I could be sari matching for the canter blankets, or helping the women in production choose thread to go with the products. Our volunteers are working in a wide range of sectors. Um, speaking from personal experience, the first volunteer I saw in action was uh, one of our previous volunteers working with UNHCR and Cox's Bazaar on the important uh, refugee needs in that part of the country. And that was quite impressive and that person was obviously highly valued by their organisation. But now, after almost three and a half years in, in, uh, in Bangladesh, I've seen our volunteers uh, working in a range of needs, from refugees, as I just mentioned, right through to physiotherapy, for example, up at the uh, Centre for the Rehabilitation of the Paralysed in, uh, in Sabah, and everything in between. 
My name is Alicia Harkins. I am from Perth, Western Australia, and I am an Australian volunteer for international development. My role at ICDDRB as an Australian volunteer is to strengthen the capacity of the team to effectively educate and demonstrate best practice for breast pumping and infant feeding. Australian volunteers are here to work and to deliver results for their host organisations and for the people of Bangladesh. Second are the longer term but equally tangible uh, benefits of building up the relationship and the people to people links and the institution to institution links between Australia and Bangladesh. Uh, these are relationships that our volunteers and their colleagues here in Bangladesh will carry around for the rest of their lives and which they can apply uh, both in their careers but which they'll take away with them at a personal level as well. So as important as results are, the relationships that the program fosters uh, are just as important. My name is Sarah Garnett and I come from Sydney, Australia. In Sydney I was working at the Children's Hospital at Westmead and had a conjoint position at the University of Sydney. I was fortunate enough to come to Bangladesh um, under the AVID, the Australian Volunteers for International Development Program which is in Bangladesh, managed by Scope Global. Here I'm working as a research officer in child and maternal health. Well, I think first the skills. We look for skilled individuals who can come here and make a difference uh, in the host organisations they work for and to the communities they're servicing. So we're looking for skilled people. We're also looking for people who want to be here. We have people coming here who have made a very conscious decision that this is where they want to be and this is what they want to do. And uh, I think that shows up in the success and the reputation of the program. My name is Mia Kelly Johnson and I'm working as a programs associate with International Development Enterprises, IDE, in Bangladesh through the Australian Volunteers for International Development Program, an Australian Government Initiative. At IDE, I work in the Agricultural Markets, Food Security and Nutrition team. We work with small farmers to engage successfully in local marketplaces through their small-scale agribusinesses. This involves building their capacity on business management, on increasing their productivity through adoption of new technologies, and also facilitating the development of market infrastructure models for farmers to work collaboratively on inputs, purchasing and aggregation of their produce. The Australian Volunteers Program is another demonstration of how we work well together. Our relationship, our activity in Bangladesh is very much about building things and helping Bangladesh realise its substantial achievements and its substantial potential. Our volunteers are contributing to that. It's a small contribution in the broader context of Bangladesh's growth, but it is a meaningful and visible and important contribution uh, from Australia's perspective. Um, I applaud the work our volunteers are doing. Uh, I look forward to many more years of Australian volunteers' contribution uh, in Bangladesh. <laughs>